What made you want to do this? Everyone asks. Since I was a kid, I read about and watched other people's adventures. The idea of having my own adventure grew into something that I slowly started to make decisions around. I couldn't ignore it, and eventually, the path was set. Amid the mundane chaos of everyday life, I decided to build a stand-up paddleboard and paddle it 2,400 miles down the Missouri River, from western Montana to St. Louis. It was time to trade my small city apartment for a tent and electrical plugs for a solar panel. I couldn't sit behind a computer every day and read about other people's adventures anymore. I had to create a trip that would influence the rest of my life. I knew there'd be a chance I regret leaving my stable job to travel down a river, but I also knew I'd definitely regret it if I didn't. My friend Josh and I head west, completing the board and enjoying the mountains along the way. Just two days before I'm to launch down the Missouri, I got to take the board for its first test paddle. After about 100 yards, I deem it fit for 2,400 miles. We press on for the headwaters, through Yellowstone towards Three Forks, Montana, we go. Alright, we didn't have any champagne, but we got a can of Moose Drool Brown Ale. Seems a little more appropriate to christen the new boat. It's going to be going down the Missouri River. So I christened the, the Muddy Moose of the Missouri. Godspeed. Thank you. As I catch my first glimpse of the headwaters, I get a bit intimidated. The water looks faster than I was expecting. It was an interesting feeling to be strapping 100 pounds of gear and food onto a board that had been in the water for maybe three minutes. I always spent years imagining this moment of setting off on a path that would take me months to complete. It was anything but anticlimactic. Here I am, making the first miles in what I hope to be a journey of a lifetime. After 22 miles, you run into this dam. And then there's a very small campsite here, and I'm the only one here. It's absolutely beautiful today. It was really exceeded my expectations of what I thought the first day would be like. Uh, I was definitely nervous when I first got in the water. Uh, I'll be going to bed very early tonight. I am exhausted. I was only on the water until 3, but it's just been grueling leading up to this. Getting everything ready and finalizing all the details. You know couple years of of dreaming of it finally finally it's happening doesn't doesn't really hasn't said in yet that I'm gonna be paddle boarding down the Missouri River to St. Louis but you know I'll just take it one day at a time to see what happens <laughs> 